tell me why do you think we have a top line on a rule sheet when we never seem to use it? Shows us the limit. Tell, tell where we can stretch so that it may seem logical and proportionate. For margin, for presentation, it looks better. I guess according to me. For leaving it blank. For me, it's for, for blank. Or maybe some, uh, you know, drawings. There should be, a, I guess, there should be a heading for everything you're writing. So before you start writing anything, in, uh, so you should give a heading to it. So I guess that space is provided for that. I think this is standard. This is a manner to use a book and copies <coughs> and notebook. Said uh, for rough work for math students. I was a math student. I used to do rough work there. Okay, because uh, you need to doodle sometimes. So space for doodling because that's what I've done. The top white space. Same with girls. They don't have heads, but they use it. They try to use it. Same with girls, they use their head, but they don't have it. Because the teacher wants it, you know, she wants to give a number above it. That is why she wants it. That is why we have a top rule line. Just to give a comment on very good, very poor, really bad. It's basically for a presentation thing. Like, uh, if we start from uh, the utmost, uh, like, a margin of the paper, it wouldn't look good. So, always we leave a space in a, in a page or in a textbook, anything, to give it a better look. Just for a for the decoration for the page, I think. Sorry, no idea. Just give it a try. You can come to my mind. No, 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 no. No, I don't have any idea. It's just something about rules. Like, uh, or you can say, okay, this is the start line. You need to start from this particular thing. So it's always similar. Like that's a rule applicable to each and every person when he starts from the nursery.